it's me, Olivia here, and today I'm going to tell you about the time my hamster got loose. So it was one Wednesday, I went in the room where I gave my pets because I was going to turn my lizard's lamp on because he needs a daylight. So, and then I decided to check on my hamster. So when I checked on her, she wasn't in her tank. So we thought maybe she was just hiding, so we took all the stuff out of her cage and we like dig through the bedding because maybe she like burrowed under it, but she wasn't. So we looked up a bunch of YouTube videos on how to find a hamster if they get loose. So we tried that and none of it worked. We set up like homemade traps all over the house and everything like that. And we thought we'd give it like two days. So we gave it two days and then nothing, none of it worked. So we cleans it all up and we decided to go to the hardware store and get um, traps, they're like humane traps. So they catch it, but they don't kill it. So then we gave that like two days, but none of that worked. And we were really worried because we were going to the beach that day. So we just put little food bowls on each floor because we didn't really know what floor she was on. So when we got back from the beach, my mom was, we were unpacking and I was, I was at camp and my mom heard noises from behind the washing machine. So she looked behind there and the hamster was behind there still alive. And she was really surprised that she was still alive because it was exactly one week later. And she was really skinny and she had cuts on her hands. But eventually my mom called her after like an hour and then we put a lid on the cage because we didn't have a lid because the cage was really tall, but now we have a lid on it. So thanks for watching, bye.